got the gem right here. That's the money maker along with its sidekick. Oh yeah, I'm excited for this one, guys. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are reviewing the Storm Proton Physics. And this is the newest release off of Storm's line. It's the newest addition to the physics line. So let's talk a little bit about these balls. Some similarities and some differences. Similarities. Both balls are asymmetrical. They both have the atomic weight block in them. And in my opinion, the atomic core is probably in my opinion, the most successful core that I have seen. Uh, these balls are very versatile. Well, I don't know about the proton physics yet. I have not thrown this ball yet, but we'll throw some shots with it here in a few minutes. So let's talk about the physics. My favorite ball in the bag all time. This ball never leaves my arsenal. It's always there every time. I got this ball right here with me in my back pocket all the time. So the physics. Uh, like I said a few seconds ago, very versatile. I can play up the lane with this ball. I can swing it. I can shape it. I can really get in deep inside, hook it, loft it. I have, I don't think I've lofted it before. Uh, I might, I may have a couple of times, but that might be a rarity for a lefty to be lofting the ball. Um, like I said, it has the atomic weight core in it, so it's definitely asymmetrical. Very strong ball. It's meant for heavy oil, longer oil patterns. Uh, but I have used this ball on more than just heavy oil, heavy volume, long oil patterns. I use this ball on every pattern ex at Junior Gold Detroit except for the short pattern. That's just how good and versatile this ball is. Um, it also... Uh, oh, my. <laughs> There's just so many things with this ball. It's just, it's such a great ball. You can use it, again, like I said, on almost anything. It's just that good of a ball. So some differences. Talk, we talk similarities. Let's talk some differences now. And we have some different finishes, and we have some different cover stocks. On the Proton Physics, we have the NEX cover stock. It has the same cover stock as the Axiom in the, that NEX cover stock. And as we all know, is the earliest reading cover stock. That Storm has ever made. For instance, and then, for not for instance, and then over here on the physics, we have the NRG cover stock. It's a very pop common cover stock as well on Storm's line. It's uh, on the IQ Nano. It's on a lot of other uh, different uh, IQ balls as well. So, the differences now for the finishes. I believe this ball, correct me if I'm wrong, Actually, don't correct me. I'll put the correct ones up here on the screen. Uh, the correct, I should say, the finish for this ball, I believe is 3,000 fin three finished. And for the physics, it is 1,000. Again, I'm going to put the correct ones here. So, we're going to go throw some shots with the, with the uh, proton physics and the physics here. Uh, just so you guys can see, these balls are not going to make very snappy motions. They're very, as you can tell, very dull balls. They're not going to snap very hard. They're going to be very arky, very smooth, but they, roll, they will roll quite early um, for sure. They will hit the pins very hard as well. Uh, I've had, I've had some, I have great carry with this ball. I, again, I'm not, not sure with Proton Physics. I haven't thrown it yet. Just got it yesterday. So let's go throw some shots. Some of those set of lanes, we're going to throw the proton physics here. We're throwing a couple shots with it here. And it's kind of, it's, it's a pretty strong ball. So uh, we're going to start here on 10 on the left side. Uh, I'm just going to throw it in between five. Five and ten. Thank you. 
As you can see, that ball hooked pretty early. Again, it's a lot of ball for the outside part of the lane here. We're probably going to be a pretty deep out there. Now I'm going to throw that same shot here with my finger. Again, a bit strike, but it, it definitely rolled and picked up pretty soon. Still a lot of ball for the outside part of the lane. So I'm going to do five boards right now. And I'm going to move in to 20. And I'm going to hit about the second arrow. I'm going to hit about five down the lane as well. And this ball is probably going to hook a lot still, but it might strike, you know. See again, that ball just shaked up. It started rolling pretty soon. Uh, style of six there. I I probably move a little bit more to the right again. It's a lot of ball. Again, it's got that NEX cover stock on it, so that ball it's going to pick up very soon. Here's the physics in that same spot here. right in there again that cover stock on the physics is not as early reading it won't pick up as soon so now I'm gonna move I'm gonna move five more right here over to 15 on the left side and this is probably the more appropriate area for this ball especially with it being brand new I'm gonna hit between 10 and 15 not going to get it out too far, maybe that's 10 down range. That was a little left, that was a bit of a bad shot, I'm going to try that again. But again, this is probably, this is probably more, probably going to be in a little more inside of this ball. I, don't know, I probably wouldn't be going up the lane with this ball very often. Again, that, that cover stock's not as early reading as the proton physics. Now I'm going to throw one last one here. This is probably the most, this is probably the area you're most likely going to throw this ball, especially when it's brand new, as mine is here. You're probably going to be in pretty deep here, I would say. I'm going to be standing on 10 on the right side. I'm going to hit 15 at the arrows and probably 10 down the right. It's, it's a very strong ball. It's got a very early reading cover stock on it. NEX cover stock, again, very early reading ball. So, I would definitely suggest playing more in with this ball, a little bit of a steeper angles. I wouldn't go, I wouldn't really get uh, too far outside with it here. I'll throw on the track for a little bit. Say. So, I would definitely suggest that ball for more inside angles, not so much up the lane. So that's the that's the Storm Proton Physics, guys. Thanks for watching. We're gonna send you back to the house now. 
All right, guys, thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video too. Maybe there's somebody out there that you know that could use a proton physics. Uh, it is high school bowling season, so you never know. Could Maybe there's a tough house out there that you have to bowl at and you just need a, a ball that that's just gonna fit the place for you, fit, fit in the bag. Uh, so if you did like uh, what you saw out of the Storm Proton Physics, I'd recommend go, going and seeing your local Storm VIP Pro Shop. They'll hook you up with a Proton Physics. Again, this is the newest release from Storm, just came out a couple weeks ago, and this is definitely gonna be one of my personal favorites, I would say for sure. Again, very early reading, has the NEX hover stock, and it has the Atomic Core, so it hits the pins pretty hard as well. Uh, definitely, a when it, like it says on Storm's website, a high flare potential, very high flare. I had about six or seven oil rings on my, on my ball uh, after my first shot with it. So I would definitely, uh, I'd definitely recommend this ball for some lower rev players or some uh, people that like to play steeper angles, play in deeper, uh, for sure. So thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to go watch our last video slash ball review the iq tour solid and don't forget and don't forget to go and like and subscribe this video click the notification bell to get updates and uh, notifications when we post new videos or announcements and don't forget to follow us on instagram at life of the lefties and also follow us on facebook same as well life of the lefties and follow cam and i personally on instagram at hayden terrace at cam kilgore thanks for watching guys we'll see you later merry christmas and happy new year to all Hey guys, Life of Lefties here, and welcome back.